Nadine? What are you staring at? I'm staring at Riley. Ooh. Riley. I'm suspicious which Riley. Him? Yes. Riley Freeman? Please you probably won't even last ten minutes with him. Oh really? Really? I Riley. Um, hi. How are you today? Um, good. How are you yourself? I'm fine. Call me tonight. Um, okay. What was that all about? I don't know. I guess Nadine just demanded me to give her a call tonight. Do you think little kid? Gee, good looking out gee. Riley, I can't believe we're doing this. Well, I can't believe it either. So, do you think I'm cute? Hell yeah. You look cuter than Cardi B. No, um. You look cuter than Sar. Look, Riley, I'm loving this. I mean, look at this. We're loving each other. We're conversating. We're both drinking Coco Mocha Latte. Thank you so much, Riley. What are you looking at me for? What do you want me to apologize? That would be nice of you, and do me another favor and calm down. Okay, I'll do that. How you doing, kid? My name's John Ellis, but people call me G.E. I'm currently Nadine's boyfriend. Riley, he is not my boyfriend. He is your boyfriend. Listen, brah, there's no need to feel that way, okay? It happens to a lot of teenage boys and guys. We men, we can go to clubs and pick up some strippers and... Riley. I'm on your side, Nadine. He's not taking you home. Better yet, you're not going anywhere with him. Negro, hold up a second. Stay the hell out of this. That's right, punk, you better leave. Shoo, talking about you gone bust a cap up in my little head. Boy, I'll beat you down so hard you'll be using your own legs as crutches. Shoo, you don't want to mess with me, I'm a Cardi B fan, foo. I'm from the ghetto streets of Chicago. Don't come back to my town. Punk. So what's your plan? I just let Nadine know I had a lot of fun and it's time to call it a date. And what if she asks why? It's because um... I'm moving back to Chicago. Okay and what if she won't buy that? Or um... I can say uh... You traded in smart girls for hoes? No! Well that would be cool cause hoes are pretty hot. Think about it Huey, you know the really cute makeup they wear? Yeah. And their real sexy panty lines. Yeah. And their breast. Definitely their breast. Oh yeah. And don't even get me started about the ass. You're macking the night shine little kid. Like I wanna just grab one. And just blow it up so huge. Where it could just. Okay now you're just tearing down the light bulb by macking the conversation sound stupid. I was trying to brighten it even more. Look it'd be better if I just come out with the truth. What's that? J.E. Hold on. You're scared of J.E.? No! I'm not. It's just that he loves Nadine so much he misses her. So I'm just gone step aside and let him get her back. What the hell you thinking, man? The girl came to you. She likes you. J.E. dumped her. She's trying to stay away from him. Actually, she dumped him. Exactly. That leaves her loving you, and her disloving him. This Logan? Nothing I'm just being irrelevant. But seriously let's get back to this. Go do your thing little kid. We'll do G. We had a lot of fun Nadine, but I think it's time for us to put this relationship to an end. Unfortunately I'll be moving states in a few days, and- Hey look it's young Robbie. J. What are you doing here? Where's Nadine? Oh you're looking for Nadine? You see young Robbie. Nadine's at my house um, washing my dishes. Okay there's something I'm still quite curious about. If she's at your crib washing your dishes, doing your laundry or vacuuming your floor or whatever, what are you doing at her crib? 
Well since she at my house doing my chores, I'm at her house doing hers, for a little show, of payback. Okay G, you're not fooling anybody. Give me your address to yo crib, I'ma go pick her up myself. Actually I left it on the counter in the kitchen wanna come pick it up? No I want you to bring it here. Just come in and pick it up. Damn, he pulled him in his house hard. Robert, will you come from by the window and come to bed? Ah, I'm sorry. Huey and Riley needs to start paying attention to what they're getting into. Robert, Riley is just going down the street to put an end to his relationship so he won't get hurt. I do when they both go out this late at night they be up to dangerous things. Trust me I know. They've been doing it since they were kids. Well they ain't kids no more Robert, they grown up now, Riley might be only 17 but he's all grown up. First of all Riley is 16, and second Huey and Riley is gone always do things that makes it feel like they're grown. That's probably why their mother didn't want to have custody for them anymore. Well let's just let them be them, come on in bed. You know Robert you sure snore like a bear when you sleep, but it's turning me on though. I did not tonight, I got a headache. Come on Tatiana give me another chance. We could have been at my house doing what we want, but you left me for Riley. Hold on, Riley is my little brother. A muscular thug is after him because he's dating his girl, I as his big bro had to go protect him. Well you can go protect your baby bro and go snuggle with yourself. Tatiana. Hello. Hello! Damn! Jay this is a bunch of BS man, I just wanted to get the address to yo crib so I can end my relationship with Nadine. Yeah I hear that before. Well other people say it just to get away from you, I'm saying it to be real. Now look John let me go right now and end the relationship with her and we can be homeboys, I really don't wish for us being enemies, you know what I'm saying? Hey while I'm here I'ma ask you, what kind of things you like to do huh? Like bag on people? Talk about the outfits? Come on man I do the same thing we can do this together no I mean? Or we can make a rap album together can you rap? Rap about hoes, rap about mac and paper, or gangster rap, you like gangster rap right? Come on Jay I gotta get out of here man. Please, shut up, you're saying too much. I don't give a damn about your stupid ass activities. You stole my girlfriend and you're gonna pay. Now look I don't think you're going to break up with Nadine is a really good idea, because I think if you were to do that you'd make her cry. Now what you can do is um. Uh. What was I thinking? I think you was gone say. I said shut up. Look don't worry about what I was talking about. I'm finna to you how I do all my enemies when y'all steal my girls. I just gotta think. Come in. Huey, where is your brother? I don't know. He should have been back 45 minutes ago. Well I wonder what's keeping him. I'm pretty worried. Your grandfather's worried too. Well I'll wait till he calls, he'll say something. Okay. Ida? Yes. Sleep tight I'll wait for him. Okay, thank you. No problem. Jay you better let me out of here right now or my granddad finds out I'm not back at the crib by midnight he's gonna kick my ass. Now let me out of here. I will soon. Soon as I'm finished with you, you're a long way from me letting you out. Yeah how long would it be for me to get out of here? You are to sit there and keep your mouth shut. I want you to suffer the way how I suffered. You stole my girlfriend. I got this whole frustration inside my mind and I can't get it out. So there's only one way I can try, and that's watching you sit here yelling let me out let me out. But to make it more entertaining, I'm gonna get the duct tape. And have you taped up? I'm gonna tape you up. I'll be right back. Hello. Huey, I need your help, I'm in trouble. 
Riley what's taken you so long you said you was gonna be back before 9. I know it's J.E.G., he's losing his mind. What is he doing Riley? He's gonna tape me up to this chair and watch me struggle Huey get here quick. I'm back. Ah, uh... Riley. 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 Damn! Yeah, be careful, be careful, be careful with me. Yeah, look. I wanna get married, like the Currys, Steph and Ayesha. I'm begging you. Shut the hell up singing Cardi B. I can't stand her. Now we're not gonna be boys yet, till you stop going out with Nadine. Bruh, I was gone to do that and you ain't even given me a chance to do so. All you had to do was give me the address to yo crib and I was gone tell her while she's doing yo chores. That you and I is gone have to stop seeing each other because J.E. is a crazy psychopath who won't unwrap me out of this damn chair. Before I crack his... J.E. is a what? A really cool person. I didn't hear you. I said J.E. is a really cool person. You are a really, really cool person, John. That's more like it. I love hearing that. Huey. Hi, Nadine. You seen Riley? No. Nope. Last time I seen him was earlier today on our date at the cafe. Why, is there a problem? Riley's in trouble. What he do? He in trouble by J.E. What? J.E. single quote us at my house. Wait, 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 yo house? Yeah, this is J.E. single quote us house. So what are you guys doing at each other houses? Can we talk about it later? We have to go save your brother. Yeah, you're right, mon. J.E., I'm telling you brah, we can do a lot of cool things together if you just let me bounce. Shut up! I don't want to hear another offer come out of your mouth. Now, since it's only me and you here, we can have us a little party. Party? There's only two of us. I can see that. All we gotta do is find some really loud music and you watch me dance. Freeze. Police. Thank God. Officer get me out of here. Sorry not my job. Hands behind your back punk, you going to jail. What did I do? Ask questions behind your cell bars. Other than that don't ask anything. This isn't over. I'm coming right back after you when I get out. Oh I'm so scared J. Ah! J is gone be gone for life. I don't have to see his bulky muscles, hear his dumbass deep voice, I don't have to smell his cheap ass cologne, I don't have to taste his dirty words and pain, I don't even have to. Now we can move on from there. Riley. Riley. Huey? Is that you? Yes it's me I came as fast as I could. Well get me out of this who knows J.E. is trying to escape from the feds. Can I at least call my girlfriend? I was supposed to go meet her. Yeah you can. You can let her know you're going to jail. Riley I am so sorry about J.E. He can be such a freak. Most of all a psychopath and a bully. Nadine, it's all straight. J.E. is gone. He in the pin. I'm not. You don't even have to deal with that punk telling you what to do. Know what I mean? Yes I know what you mean. Well it's getting late I have to get in. So I'll see you tomorrow for another date. Fosho. I'll see you then. Bye, Huey. See you later, Nadine. Huey, you saved my life. How can I ever repay you? Eh, uh, let's not go that far. Any time for the help, but let's not do all that. We're Huey and Riley Freeman, not Sean and Marlon Wayerns. My bad. But you have no idea how scared I was Huey. Jay could have did anything to me. Like he could have pretended to be Scarface and cut me to death with his chainsaw. Or pour gas liquid to set me on fire. Or he could have uh... Look thank god it's over Riley. But before we leave I got one question. What's up? Have you lost your mind child? Huh? You know how worried you got me Ida and Grandad. Hold up, I got taped into a chair, 
non-violently tortured by J.E., you came and saved me an hour and 30 minutes later and this is my fault? <laughs> Chilex lil kid, I'm just messing with you. But look what I was really gon' say was, if there's a girl that likes you you gotta check if they're currently with a boyfriend. Because he can be up to anything, you know, he can be sharing his feelings with you just to show off his jealousy. Yeah you right G, I didn't even check if Nadine was still in a relationship with J.E. It's all straight now, he's already in jail. I guess that leaves Nadine being all yours. Yeah I know. Woo. Okay let's get back home brah. Fasho G. Riley Freeman where in the name of George Jefferson have you been? Do you have any idea what time it is? You got me and yo granddaddy over here worried. We thinking you out here doing anything. Boy I out to slap the ghetto behavior out of you. That was too far? Riley Freeman where in the name of George Jefferson have you been? Do you have any idea how upset I am? You just broke the script. I showed it. Riley Freeman where in the world of Mercury have you been all night? Boy do you have any idea? Ooh I'm too old for this. Yes you are. Yes you are. Riley Freeman, we're in the- <laughs> Yeah, you can't do it like how you used to. Rock to the rhythm, you don't stop.